A few days ago, the first ship of China's Type 076 amphibious assault ship was launched, named Sichuan Ship, port number 51. In the last two days, the development and positioning of the Type 076 amphibious assault ship has become a hot topic of discussion. However, a question has arisen. Compared to the previous 075 amphibious assault ship, the brand new 076 amphibious assault ship, in the end, can carry what type of aircraft? Or, 076 type amphibious assault ship, in the end, can catapult which fighters? Today, we will talk about this issue. First of all, let's talk about the 075 amphibious assault ship carrying mode. 75 amphibious assault ship, belonging to the development of China's first amphibious assault ship, but also a very standard configuration of the amphibious assault ship. Fully loaded displacement of 35,000 tons to 40,000 tons. As of December 2024, a total of four ships have been built. Currently, three have been commissioned, namely, the Hainan, Guangxi and Anhui ships, with the fourth ship expected to be commissioned in 2025, the Type 075 amphibious assault ships number 4. Port number 34 is not much of a problem. About the name of the ship, there is still a lot of controversy, according to speculation on the network, roughly named after the central provinces. As a moderate amphibious assault ship, Type 075 amphibious assault ship mainly focus on amphibious strike, amphibious delivery only. For example, it has a very large garage, docking bay, can carry air cushion landing craft, amphibious landing craft, 05 type amphibious combat vehicles and other equipment. As for the aviation operation capability, as of 2024, the 075 type amphibious assault ship has carried VZ-10, CARD 28, CARD 31, straight 8C, straight 20J and other helicopter models. With the continuous development of China's aviation industry, it is expected to launch 10-ton heavy armed helicopters and 35-ton heavy transport helicopters, basically benchmarking the U.S. A-64 and CH-53 series helicopters. In addition, it will also carry a variety of small and medium-sized drones. After all, drones belong to the standard. However, since China does not have a vertical takeoff and landing fighter similar to the F-35B, in terms of aviation combat capability, it is significantly limited. Therefore, the Type 075 amphibious assault ship, mainly carrying a variety of different helicopters, small and medium-sized drones, the Navy has developed the Type 076 amphibious assault ship from practical missions. Please note that the Type 076 and Type 075 are not substitutes, but rather complementary and mutually supportive. Of course, the status of the amphibious assault ship Type 076, obviously higher, appeared, big to attack, small aircraft carrier, said, 76 type amphibious assault ship tonnage, obviously than 075 type amphibious assault ship, much larger, the media generally speculated that at least 50,000 tons, the deck adopts the design of large outer floating, can carry more continue, while maintaining the amphibious carrying capacity, the addition of electromagnetic catapults and blocking ropes, greatly strengthened aviation operations capabilities, therefore, the type 076 amphibious assault ship, directly separate gangway. Then, compared with the 075 type, 076 type can carry which types of aircraft? First of all, 075 type amphibious assault ship can carry all the models. 076 type amphibious assault ship can also carry. According to the different tasks of the actual combat, adjust the configuration of the carrier aircraft. Compared with the 075 type, the 076 type amphibious assault ship, due to the electromagnetic catapult and blocking cable, can catapult a variety of large and medium-sized drones, such as the famous Attack 11 or Rainbow series of drones and so on. Take the Attack 11 UAV as an example. The maximum takeoff weight is 10 tons, and the built-in magazine mounting capacity is 2 tons. Maximum flight speed of 0.9 Mach, maximum range of 4,000 km, combat radius of 1,500 km, maximum endurance of more than 6 hours. From the Attack 11 range, combat radius and air time, almost in full fuel state of the J-15 fighter, basically equivalent. 076 type amphibious assault ship, if catapulted to take off more than 10 or even more than the Attack 11 drones, the comprehensive striking effect can be seen, not only Attack 11, but also can catapult other different large and medium-sized drones. The key depends on the actual needs of the Navy. A question arises, type 076 amphibious assault ship can only catapult a variety of drones. Personally, I don't think so. Of course, in the daily mission mode, Type 076 amphibious assault ship 
certainly to carry a variety of helicopters, drones, however, if the actual mission needs, for example, there is no aircraft carrier in the area, naval ships or submarines in urgent need for carrier support, 76-type amphibious assault ship after clearing the deck, also able to catapult different carrier aircraft. First of all, I personally believe that the 076 amphibious assault ship, according to the actual needs, Catapult Coach 10 series of trainer attack aircraft. Coach 10 belongs to China's development of advanced trainer. At the same time, on the basis of Coach 10, launched a light attack aircraft version. The maximum takeoff weight of the Coach 10 is more than 9 tons, and the light combat attack aircraft version, the maximum takeoff weight reaches about 11 tons. With 7 9 mounting points, the maximum mounting capacity is around 3 tons. Relying on a maximum mount of about 3 tons, the Coach 10 has been able to meet a variety of low intensity, a variety of ground and sea strike missions. Attack 11 belongs to the 10-ton class UAV, and the combat attack type of Coach 10 has a maximum takeoff weight of 11.3 tons. For the Type 076 amphibious assault ship, there is no practical problem to catapult the Coach 10. In addition to the Coach 10, there is also a very controversial model, which is also the most difficult to determine, that is the J-35 fighter. As we all know, the J-35 is divided into Navy type, Air Force type and export foreign trade type. From the current situation, China's various types of aircraft carriers are able to carry, take off, and land J-35 series of fighters. The key is the skidding takeoff, or catapult takeoff is different. The Fujian ship and all types of Chinese carriers, after it are capable of catapulting J-35 series fighters. Theoretically, the electromagnetic catapults on the Type 076 amphibious assault ship are also capable of catapulting J-35S. At least in terms of technology, there is not much difficulty. After all, the catapult is of sufficient length to be able to eject J-35S. Personally, I think, in general, 076-type amphibious assault ship will not carry catapult J-35 fighters because the process of carrier aircraft landing and takeoff is very complex, and the difficulty is also greatly increased. Please note that it is, under normal circumstances, which does not mean that it cannot be catapulted. If the actual combat mission is urgent, for example, the number of aircraft carriers is insufficient, the need to carry out large-scale, large-formation joint operations at sea, then, Type 076 amphibious assault ship, before leaving harbor, can also carry a certain number of J-35 fighters, or, the carrier aircraft on other carriers, able to land in the 076 amphibious assault ship, resupply, and again catapult takeoff operations. At least, theoretically, the Type 076 amphibious assault ship, with the above capabilities. The key lies in whether the Navy needs a similar mode of carriage. Therefore, the Type 076 amphibious assault ship is very high positioning, and the Type 075 amphibious assault ship use mode, but also the difference is obvious.